off about our quote unquote connection because you threw me in a video, Miss Crystal. <laughs> yeah, I did. Along with, along with some of my castmates, uh, which was hilarious. You kind of shouted out my failed rap career and Howard University stint, which is. He attended Howard University but dropped out after one year and also attempted a rap career. Like a pimp rap. Slap. So what's happening, my Mackin? You know, big bottom thrashing and smashing. Yep. University stint, which is yeah, love. I love. I ain't tripping. I'd rather somebody else tell the story than me, right? Um, but can you just talk to us a little bit about how you, you got into covering, you know, uh, Black child stars and people from the past? Because you be doing a whole lot of, like, where'd they go type. Because <laughs> I'm like, damn, I made it to the where we go post. You know, I'm happy about that. <laughs> Yeah, so um, I guess I was always considered a pop culturist. Like I, when I was growing up, I loved everything about celebrities. And it's probably because I grew up in the Caribbean and I just thought it was so cool seeing all these people on TV. I freaking love all that. And you know, I had to do a special yeah. edition, all <laughs> that, um, where are they now cast or whatever. Because I think, I mean, no shade to the rest of the cast, but who really shined to me as a kid were the black kids. Cause mm. I saw myself. You know, yeah. I will give them credit there. Like, you know, we, they really let us be ourselves, especially me. Cause I'm going to say, I say it all the time. I really didn't have a whole lot of talent other than just being myself and people uh, found some appeal to that. And so they yeah. allowed me to shine in uh, you know, as Leroy and Fuzz, as uh, opposite coach Creighton, uh, every once in a while, I put on a character with Repair Boy, but in a lot of ways, they just embra embraced who I was and and uh, let me be myself. So much appreciated. All that provided, you know, diversity, not just all that, but Nickelodeon. I got, you know, we had um, Keenan and Kel, Cousin Skeeter, all those cool ass shows. It's a, it's a shame, you know, they don't exist like that anymore. I feel like we don't have representation these days. It's more like tokenism. So... You know, Ride nostalgia.